In this video guys, Minitune has confirmed Piggy 2 will be coming out probably in the near future. Before the video starts guys, if you guys have not clicked that subscribe button already, I really do appreciate it because most of you guys are not subscribed to the channel, only 1.6 of you guys are subscribed to the channel. I really do appreciate you guys click that subscribe button. Now let's move on to the video. So yesterday Minitune did a live stream on YouTube and he basically answered a a lot of questions about Peggy, his personal life, etc. Minitune now has a YouTube channel, by the way. It's called Minitune. He almost, he almost has 100,000 subscribers. But a lot of good players are asking him questions about Peggy 2, Bunny, TSP, his dogs, etc. Does How do you meet Ikea? So, I'm, I have compiled a bunch of clips from his live stream, like basically like the top 10 most important questions and answers that we needed, to, needed answered for Piggy 2, Ikea, etc. So, I'm gonna let those clips play out. Wait a minute. Okay, I thought this person was outside the fence. Next question. Who is TSP? Um, that's a good question. I don't think I'm gonna be answering that one. I think that one will pass, but, uh... I think if Piggy 2 ever comes out, then I will be answering it definitively in that game. When Piggy 2. <laughs> when is Piggy 2 coming? That is the first one I'm, I see. Uh, so the thing with Piggy 2 is I definitely want to get this game mode out of the way and I want to, you know, finish the cutscenes for uh, chapters 1 and 3. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is so laggy. But I have been thinking of story ideas that I can do for Piggy 2, because I want it to start with tons of story, like, uh, I don't know, let's say chapter 5 level of story, like, you know, we actually have story to go off of, not just, um, oh, here we are, let's get out of here sort of thing. So uh, that's pretty much all I have for Piggy 2, I don't know if I will do it, but I've been thinking of a story for it, just in case, just in case I ever do it. Is Pony X Zizzy real, Minitune? Asked by Hayuga Philip. I'm so sorry if I butcher names again. Sorry. Uh. Um. I don't know. You know, Pony Secret could have been anything, honestly. It could have been something, you know, relationship wise. It could have been just something that he's been meaning to tell her about their situation. Who knows? Next question in tube, will chapter 1 to 3 get ending cutscenes? Yes, they will. They will most certainly get ending cutscenes. I believe I'll be doing this after the mode comes out, but it's something I definitely 100% want to do because I really want to develop the characters and even relationship between Doggy and the player. Okay, Jaden Yu asks, how will the new game mode work? So the new game mode is kind of going to be like Bloxburg in the sense that you can make neighborhoods. So in the main menu, there's going to be an option called build mode. And there's going to be um, basically like when you click on it, you have to type in a name and you'll be able to join that person uh, depending on their, you know, privacy settings in the game. Like if they're in a world where it's friends only or just no one, then you can't join. But uh, if they have it set to like public, you can just join them. And I think the max players I'll do for that is probably a hundred. I don't know, maybe I'll make it set by the player, like to be able to choose how many players you want in your game. So that's uh, that's kind of how the joining works. As for the mode itself, you're gonna have like a bunch of uh, blocks and props and stuff that you can just click on and then just place it anywhere in the world. It's gonna sort of be like Minecraft in the sense that you're using your character to move around and actually build the stuff. But I don't think this is the legitimate one. I think this might be just a fan. So I'll just say Creecraft fan. <laughs> Will Bunny come back uh, in Piggy 2? If I do make a Piggy 2, maybe. Maybe as a flashback, maybe, who knows. Is here, sorry for the name butcher. How did you get to know Ikea's? Um, well, it came by or she came by from one of my old games called containment breach i don't know if you know what that is it's very very unpopular compared to piggy it's got like about 100 to 200 players on average um she wanted to help build for the game and i was like okay uh let's see what you've got for me and she builds like this whole friggin cathedral oh sorry i, I said friggin i meant to say flippin i'm sorry 
you know what, cancel me, I rip. But yeah, she builds this whole flipping uh, cathedral, and I'm like, wow, <laughs> is this even Roblox? Like, it was so laggy, but it was so beautiful at the same time. So, then we, uh, then I hired her, and um, she's helped me on other games, because she's very, a very, very talented builder. Way better than me. Monumental. Like, she's insane. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> she... Um, she's helped me on my game called Iron Assault. She built maps for it. And of course, she helped me with Piggy as well. So, how was the crossover with, or how did the crossover with Jailbreak start? Um, it actually started as a joke. I think it was uh, my username's this. He just asked, uh, like a random question, like Piggy x Jailbreak when? And then, uh, Asimo and I were like, haha, yeah, real funny. And then we just actually started talking in DMs right after about a crossover, so that's kind of how it started. Just from a joke. That's how most of my things have started, honestly. You know, like, Piggy started as a joke. Uh, <laughs> the crossover started as a joke. I think the stream might have... You know, because I've always joked about having a YouTube channel with my friends. But here I am, because of all the fakes, and also because I wanted to answer a lot of your questions live. And I wanted to get as many people as possible, you know, in on this, so. Alright, let's- Is your favorite piggy theory? Uh, that's a tough one. I'll say right now, my least favorite is- Well, there's a lot of great theories out there, but like, I can tell you which one I don't really like is- uh, the, you know, it's all a dream thing, because I, I don't think that's a really creative way of doing things. I've already done it's in a dream, kind of, in the distorted memory map, you know, when George wakes up. I, or it could have been a memory, but, like, I don't know, I don't think this whole, I want this story to be, like, it's actually happening. But it could be in a dream, you know, it's a theory, once again, I'm not gonna say it's wrong, I'm just saying, uh, I prefer other theories over it. Okay, uh, let me think of a theory I do like, though. I did like the theories that Mr. P was good all along. Those ones were my favorites back then. Uh, that one's been kind of semi-proven. I mean, like, he's chaotic good. He's trying to do the right thing, but he's, you know, uh, not very good at it. <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, next question is by Amara Kayun. Sorry for the name butcher. Did you know your game would go viral? Absolutely not. If anything, I didn't think it was going to pass 100 players, but lo and behold, it's got nearly 100 times that. So, yeah. But, you know, uh, it's not my game, right? You know, you got these developers on board, but it's also you guys. It's a community making this game as big as it is. As it is. So it's not really a milestone that I can celebrate alone. It's for all of us to really celebrate, like, its success, because you all took part in this, and you were all a very, very essential part of making the game, because you guys motivated me to make this, so. Um, RB what? <laughs> By Heiosu. RB, so RB uh, Battles is like the, this annual uh, event where uh, a bunch of Roblox uh, people get together and get put into this tournament. I think Creecraft actually won the last one, but uh, they go through games and uh, they compete for who is the best Roblox player or champion. And uh, Piggy is going to have an event that will go along with the tournament. And um, we're gonna have competitors essentially play in Piggy in a certain mode or map, wink wink, who knows, and uh, we'll see who is the, um, the Piggy champion, uh oh, uh oh, what do we have here, a few glitchers, I will fix that, <laughs> and Danko is just in the ground, but yeah, that's what RB Battles is, and that's what the event is gonna be, we're gonna have something really big for Piggy coming soon, so, uh, next question. So hopefully those clips have answered a bunch of your questions about Minitune, Piggy, etc. Because I'm pretty high for Piggy 2 if Piggy 2 does come out because 
Piggy is literally becoming a brand at this point. If you guys know what I mean, a brand. They're at getting action figures. They already have merch, hoodies, plushies are coming out. You're kidding me? Plushies? Next could be pillows, mugs, I don't know, banners. You never know. So I am pretty sure Piggy 2 will come out in the near future. I'm pretty sure about that because it's literally becoming a brand at this point that... One of the biggest brands on Roblox, personally a lot bigger than Jailbreak because they have plushies, their own store, hoodies, etc. A bunch of stuff. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, I really appreciate it. If you guys click that subscribe button and click that like button, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good day. Good night, guys. Peace out. Bye.